Oh, and he has a film out. It's called Get On Up. It premiered last night at the Apollo Theater in New York. Jill Scott plays Brown's second wife. And last night, Jill got to meet her for the first time in front of our ET cameras. Oh, my goodness. Can I call you? Yes, you may. You may call me D. The hugs and the tears play out an arm's length away. Hit it! We have not met before. We just sent messages through family. I didn't, really did not want to talk to her just yet. Get on up here, Mr. Dynamite. We saw some of it, not the completion of it, but uh, what we saw was very, very good. And it's true life, and it was my life. Didi and I are about to get it, okay? <laughs> Several family members at the premiere. Grandson Jason Brown was on set every day, helping producer Mick Jagger get it right. They were very involved in it, you know, from the get-go. The premiere at Harlem's Apollo Theater, for good reason, says Chadwick Boseman, who perfected those moves for the movie. Ah, I feel good. James Brown performed here over 200 times. His body was laid to rest here on the stage for people to view. And I brought his body here, and I preached his funeral here. Uh, I first saw him here. It's pretty electrifying. It really was. Okay, you got to be so impressed with Chadwick's performance because he actually did not know how to dance before the film, and he actually practiced five hours a day to get James Brown just right.